there we go. Uh, <laughs> oh, what? Yay, what the heck? Uh, oh, hi everyone and welcome aboard. I'll be your Captain Alien today, along with... Uh, Please, the mighty Lieutenant Rakir at your service, and what the... Uh, uh, okay, okay. okay. <laughs> I, I messed up, uh, I messed up with something here. So I'll have to revert that back to the original for the moment. And you'll probably want this back. Uh, come on there. Thank okay. You. Okay, I'll have that fixed before next time. But uh, yeah, welcome to Alien Isolation, which will be our Spooktober game for this month. And uh, yeah, <laughs> I did a bit of a re... Not a rework, but uh, just a recolor of, well, <laughs> me here. I probably overdone it with the contrast of colors but oh well it's a temporary thing and well let's actually press any key <laughs> yeah and also welcome to jupiter i i think it's jupiter no pretty sure this is somewhere far far away <laughs> and yeah we have the base game and then we have some extra stuff survivor mode last survivor and crew expendable i forget if i have these i got this from gog so I think it's all included, but yeah, we're going to be focusing on the main game, of course. So let's start on medium. Yes, I did start a bit for, well, testing if this will actually work with OBS and such. Okay. Segson? Okay, I and, feel like the they made that visible. name. I feel like they made that name before that the word became a meme for something else. Okay, I probably put that a bit too dark, but it'll be all the more fitting. Century Fox, of course, because they are the final yeah, report the of the right commercial holder. starship Nostromo. Third officer reporting. The other members of the crew Kane, Lambert, Parker, Brett, Ash, and Captain Dallas are dead. Cargo and ship destroyed. I should reach the frontier in about six weeks. With a little luck, the network will pick me up. This is Ripley. Last survivor of the Nostromo. Signing off. And yes, that was actually Ripley's uh, actress. Ripley? I'm Samuels. I work for the company. It's about your mother. We think we may have found her, Amanda. A commercial vessel, the Anisadora, has recovered what we believe to be the flight recorder unit of the Nostromo. Where? Zeta Reticula. What did it tell you? We don't know. The unit was taken to Sevastopol Station. It's proprietorial material, so the company wants it to be collected as soon as possible. Sevastopol's a supply depot in the region. It's a, a permanent freeport. I know what it is. Transit's arranged. There's a courier ship called the Torrens heading out that way in two days. We're going to travel out. We? Oui. Me and another exec. And you, if you're willing. Look, Ripley. When this job came across my desk, 
I read the case history. I know why you're working in the region where she went missing. You're still looking, aren't you? I've been cleared to offer you a place on the Torrents if you want to come along. Maybe there'll be some closure for you. Yep, Ripley's daughter. And hello to her in chat, and hello, Malice Kiva. <laughs> Yep. Hope you'll enjoy and the hello, show. Little Yes and Marco. And one space flight who knows how long later. Because well space travel in this universe absolutely blows. And yeah, how how are you how are you all doing today? Uh, Jess, Marco, and uh, Malice, if I may call you that for short. Okay. And uh, yeah, I don't think this game needs too much introduction. It's Alien Isolation. It's a really freaking good game. And yeah. well, perfect one to start Spooktober with. Oh yeah, also a game <laughs> with a bit of a sad story. Thank you for the follow, Malice Coon. <laughs> yeah, Malice, if I, if I may call you that. Uh, let's see, Jess, am I going to be terrified with this game? I mean, it's Alien. Keep the huggers away from me. <laughs> uh, that won't happen yet. Yeah. And let's see, Marco just opened up a bag of Doritos. I just packed over a bag of chips, so cream, and uh, yeah, just before stream, I was talking to Durban Lord, and they uh, something similar with the, they have with yes here. Just they don't like the the chest bursters. Yeah. Chris, I understand, and I understand face hugs like face hugs look. Almost at this distance of not disturbing. But the true horror of them comes to what they do to you. Yeah. Uh, also something I found during uh, the testing. Yeah, that's already an extra point for me from having an actual physical body to look at. Okay, Ripley, get dressed. Yeah. And for people wondering what I said, there is a sad story. I again ruined the as any chance was a sequel for this game due to if you wanna have someone to re review a game, you send someone that does play horror games on regular, right? Mm, I haven't played too many horror games. I've played uh, Fear, uh, never finished it. But... Uh, I mean, if you were to do a review of a game that's a horror, uh, horror game, you would send a person that plays horror games regularly, right? Yeah. They didn't. Uh, I did not. They sent someone completely else that just trash the entire game yeah which has yeah. been a very 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 frequent thing with game quote-unquote reviews lately yeah and I've, i think that was all the thing before but that won't be at the end and this game really put that problem on the map okay all right save data yes these are our save stations but do hope... we can't use them when enemies are nearby, it did say. Oh dear. I don't hope they do make more of these games. If they got a chance, since many years now they probably will just have seen that. Oh yeah, our game did, did not suck. Everyone loved it actually. They just had a very bad, uh, what, what would you call them? Journalist? Reviewer, staffer. Reviewer? Yeah. Idiot. <clears throat> Let's see. Just missed you. Verlaine, you on the lookout for a navigational officer? I have a friend that just lost his ship and he's looking for work. I can vouch for him, he's got good papers. Same old story, the America Corps on the cut him, picked up uh, all his clients. Contracts are getting harder to come by for the smaller companies and, and I'm thinking of getting my, out myself while I still have something to sell. Sounds like you're doing okay though. Dropped by the docks and heard you just shipped out. Sevastopol Station, what a shithole. Still, I hear Wayland Yutani pay well. Good luck to you. If you can't beat him right, let's catch up when you get back. Okay. Nah. Let's see what we can do and, well, see if we can get our hands on that recorder. So that Amanda can learn a thing or two about what happened to uh, her mother. Uh, 
Yeah, don't think we want to go that way. Uh, let's see, Marco. IGN sucks. Black Myth Wukong got voted for number one uh, community game of the year. And they refused to accept it, so they picked the number two voted game of the year, which was Final Fantasy VII Rebirth. Uh, that's... Oh, hello there. Taylor, good morning. Ripley, it's certainly not good. And I very much doubt it's morning either. Sorry. I feel like death. I don't know how you people put up with hypersleep regularly. You get used to it. I don't do long haul very often. Most legal execs don't travel further than the coffee machine. I'm surprised Raylan Yutani felt the need to send legal at all. The loss of the Nostromo and its cargo cost the company a lot of money. It's important we find out what happened. If I can close the case with a conclusive accident report, it'll look great with my superiors. I'm sorry. That was insensitive. Realize your mother has been missing for 15 years and, and you... It's okay. We'll both get what we want, right? Uh, have you seen Samuels? He's probably been up for hours. I'll catch up with him. Okay. Let's see. There was something this way. Uh, Malice, the Hayden, Lol, Marco. Mind you, there was well over a 20, uh, 20k vote difference. Yeah. Like, I'm. All the big reviewers and such, at this point, they just can't be trusted. Because, yeah, if they. Basic, but yeah, the thing with it is that they've basically gone more corporate than anything else. Uh, so, yeah, if they give, uh, if they give uh, games bad reviews, then it's likely. That the you know, companies will cut off their access to like uh, previews and such, which will, you know, <laughs> first come first. Oh, yep, yep, Ripley. Yep, Sam never mind. House. Did you wake up early? Well, I don't really need as much sleep as the rest of you. I was just inspecting the Torrens facilities, a well maintained ship. I realize it's a very similar model to the Nostromo. Yes, M class. A later pattern, but close in spec. I've worked engineering jobs on ships like this. Of course. Is Taylor up yet? She's not a seasoned traveler. Hypersleep may have been punishing for her. We talked. She seems nervous. Hmm. I hadn't noticed. She's a skilled executive, though. Should help us with any legal issues we might encounter. Well, yeah, basically, big review companies and such. Looks like we're up. Are scared to be actually critical of uh, gaming companies and such, because well, it can cost them access, and yeah, basically it's not for first served and such, first come first serve, but uh, yeah, they do want to get exclusives and such, so, which in a way makes it somewhat understanding, but it doesn't, it does undercut their integrity immensely. Because they are just, they just will not rev uh, review accurately, which will kills off the pr <laughs> the whole reason why they exist, if you ask me. Yeah, and you know, sometimes it seems like they are. How to say this? Almost and sometimes at the point that you see like a hidden agenda behind the reviews. Yeah, let's see, Marco Malice knows who gives truthful information. The only news I believe is the fish anchor from the kitty bottom. Okay. <laughs> yeah, let's see. Uh, to Taylor, Nostromo, Instant, Wailing Johnny, blah, 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 blah. Hey, Taylor, I got your case request. It may take me a while to dig out the files in the incident that happened before my time at the company, so I'm a bit fuzzy on the details. In 2122, the Wayland Johnny cargo vessel, the Nostromo, went missing. No trace was found of its cargo or crew. Apart from a new science officer, the rest of the queue had worked together before, seven in all. Uh, Dallas, the captain, as the science officer, Kane, or was it Kane, <laughs> executive officer, Ripley, warrant officer, and Lambert, navigation officer. Okay, the Torrance Manifest. Uh, da -da -da. Diane Verlaine is the captain. Common uh, navigation by William Connor. Owner is Di Okay, captain and owner. Uh, contracted by William Yutani. Unbound and return transportation for Wayland Yutani retrieval team to Sevastopol. Uh, ta -ta -ta, three, uh, yeah, three employees. Uh, Samuels. Oh, and a bunch. Hmm? Okay, and some passengers. Two decks. Wait, not. Oh, no. 
I think I read that wrong. Christopher Samuels, Amanda Ripley, and Nina Taylor. Two. Okay, so Taylor counts as the uh, get yeah, as the passenger, then I guess. And yeah, as everyone can see, this is very chunky technology. Oh yeah, but it kind of makes sense. Yeah, this is how people thought uh, the in the eighties how space uh, yeah, space travel would be. Yeah, no, it could be at least for industrial ships. It may this may make sense. The Torrens is in very good order for an old M class captain. She was a wreck when I bought her. It took a few years and a lot of contracts to refit. She pays for herself now. You said we're approaching Sevastopol Station. Are we docking? I believe your contact is Marshal Waits, is that right? I'll hail Sevastopol and arrange boarding with him. Good. Let's get this done. Don't worry, Miss Taylor. Routine. In and out. Connor, how are we doing? SMG loaded and calibrated. Approach vector locked. Prep comm so I can say hello. Channel open, Captain. Does everyone have their briefing documents? You can watch the approach on the monitors. Yeah, briefing uh, documents? People want to say that some of them may see uh, these reviews seem to have an agenda. I must have talked about the ones that seem to like to do, I guess you would call rage baiting or just. Uh, yeah. Yeah, half a truth and a lot of lies. Yeah. And Marcus out of the readers already. That was quick. But yeah. I must have done, but now that it was the reviews, I used to watch. Can we see it. Switch to monitors. Sevastopol Station. Is that damage? It looks like damage. Punch up 74, tight angle. Looks like the dry dock bay is screwed. I can't bring the Torrens into that. This is a commercial vessel Torrens out of St. Clair, registration number MSV7760, calling Sebastopol Traffic Control. We're carrying three passengers on a whale and Utani Bond. You're holding the Nostromo flight recorder unit. We request immediate permission to transfer the passengers port side over. This waits, Colonial Marshal, Sebastopol State, serious situation. Hello, Marshal? Mar Marshal, this is the Torrens. Say again. Well, that's no good. The station's comms seem pretty screwed up, so I fitted Samuel's suit with a radio booster. I can only keep the Torrens in transit for 24 hours. You'll have heard from us by then. Safe trip. Stand by. My contract doesn't cover bloody spacewalks. It's the only option. And it's perfectly safe if you do what I tell you. Depressurizing. Oh, fuck. Hating this. Just shadow me, Taylor. You too, Samuels. Affirmative. Well, it's not called Alien Party of Three, now is it? Yeah. But I was to say, none of the what you reviews, I watched them review older games.
Back. Let's get out of the suit. Actually, since we're talking about Ryu is doing Uri, I should check what CV11 has been doing of late. Okay. That's an, that's an example of a good reviewer. Yeah, he doesn't take himself too seriously at all. Indeed, and there are many good reviews about out there, just... Yeah. yeah. Be careful of who you watch. There we go. Yeah, most of the, for the most part, independent reviewers are more likely to get you actually, well, good reviews. They all have their own biases, of course, so don't go asking someone who mainly reviews RPGs about uh, stuff with shooters. Oh. Yeah. But yeah, with a bit of looking, you can probably get or find someone. And yeah, things have gone um, quite the hell, huh? Oh dear. Luckily, we have crawl spaces. But yeah, Alien is, I believe, what you'd call a hard sci fi uh, franchise. As in, well, they don't fuck around with too much. Uh, <clears throat> too much uh, super science and such. Part of why, well, there was no sound out in space. Hardly any, because, well, sound don't travel through empty space. Yeah. Corrupted folder. Decommissioning. To the engineering thing, a team. So, boys and girls, you've probably heard the whispers about Sevastopol by now, and I can confirm it's official. Sevastopol is being dis decommissioned. I will go over each of you. Know, over with each of you what this means in regards to your contracts and next placement, but for now we still have a job to do. The suits will uh, the suits want this done with a skeleton crew, which means we'll only be getting a few outside contract yeah, contractors to help, but it does mean overtime. I recommend taking what you can while it's available. I should point out that the decommission does not mean lucky dip. Everything here has to be accounted for, and I will personally es escort anyone found helping themselves to equipment to Marshall Waits. Okay. Well, that certainly is not helping things if there's, well, too few crew to help repair things. That's yeah. locked. I, I guess it is. I could see it be doing sh spaceships like this in the future still. At least for the industrial ones. And that was probably a burnt hand. Ow. Oh, yeah, sense. Yeah. It's an industrial ship. It's not made to be fancy. Yeah. God damn. Hello? This will help. Okay. Q for the radio. And R to activate. Okay. And yeah, this game is actually dark, dark. Okay, see to crouch. Okay, we can even throw it. If someone, someone new, you always know a working Joe. Okay. We can either throw this thing or place it down. Well, that's... Oh, no, not stuck. Okay, so we don't need to crawl any further through the baggage line. Nope. Everyone is responsible for safety. Keep moving. Okay. And something on the stairs wall? The... Oh, hello. Let's see. Oh, that's a relic. No. Blueprints. Yeah, big old boom boxes like this. I personally would like to own one of those, but I just don't have the space. Hello? Anyone here? A model of the station. Three spires. Connecting bits. 
forgotten. <laughs> Fuck you. Trust no one. Keep out and pay or something. They use these terminals to update your map. Which terminals? Out here. Okay, orange terminals. Nope. We'll do that three times. Three light bulbs. No, that's just a generator. And what? What was it about? Okay, we can at least save the game. Yeah, this takes some time. And the thing is a bit noisy. Let's see. Uh, moved our stash. Langley, if you're looking for our stash, I've moved it. You left it right out in the open where anyone could have taken it. Jesus, do you know what I had to do to get it? I've hidden it in one of the sterile rooms. You should be able to find this. The code is 0341... What? 0340? Don't worry, no one got us down to terminal anymore. Not after what happened. Also, we're out of meds and low on water, so you're going to need to get some. It's your turn. Maybe it'll teach you to take care of our stuff in the future. Okay, I'll make a note of that, because I don't know if the game will keep note. And now I need to fumble around in the dark on my desk for where I left the damn pen. There it is. Okay. Terminal 0340. Okay. Oh, goodbye from Siegson. The decommissioning of Sebastopol Station. We've had a long journey together, but sadly it's coming to an end. Siegson Corp would like to th take this opportunity to thank all of you who've yeah, who worked and lived at Sebastopol over the years and hopes that Siegson has helped to make it a productive and rewarding environment. Our investment and belief in the station has never wavered. Be assured that Seekson's Apollo, Central AI, and Working Joe Androids will be there to serve Sebastopol until the last rivet is removed. We wish you all the very best for the future. After all, Sebastopol isn't just a station, it's people. Seekson Corp. Kill the power. Oh, we can actually play it. Harris, Turner, get back here now. We have a track somewhere in engineering. Lock the terminal down, kill the power, and don't forget your reports. Make them thorough. We're gonna need our paperwork to be bulletproof when this shit's over. Wait up. Okay. Power Junction D13 departures. Restore yeah. power to depart. There we Hold go. Up, no, but his name, or last name is Wait. Yep. Oop. I'm going, I'm going. Okay, we're not the only ones here. Okay, now what was that about what we can use to update our map? Hmm. Okay, seriously, what was that about updating our map? Because the only thing I saw nearby was that, that, that generator. Is there something I missed? Oh, here. Okay. I thought those were lights. Uh, let's see. Welcome to the end of the line. Tomorrow, no... To, uh, tomorrow, together, no future. Help. This life for... Rent? Okay. Can we go through... Yes, we can. Okay. I do want to check what's back here and where those people went. Okay. Yeah, this place is uh, falling apart. Yeah. Mr. Bordeaux, for how long has this been going on? Okay, whatever they were running from, potentially. They seal the door behind them. Both times, it seems. Okay, so we do need to go that way. Let's see. Injector and some scrap. Yes, there is a crafting system in this game. 
So we do want whatever goodies we can get our hands on. Okay. Security checkpoints. Okay. okay. Yep. Ow. Just as I was like, to say, careful of what live wires. Sensor, medkit, injector. Okay, we Okay, we can make med kits, but we lack materials. Okay. Hmm. What the hell happened here? Okay, now we're asking that. Not when well part of it fucking blew off and probably killed two of your colleagues. Yeah, whatever ha happened here, the decommissioning did not help at all, or potentially even caused it. Okay, let's put a bit of a move on behind it. Let's see, will this open? No. No entry. I feel like something happened during the decommissioning. Waits light to us. Locked. We need an ion torch for that. Okay. Best on the station. Probably the only one on the station. Still three stars is not bad. There's that... If that's three star reviews or three Michelin or whatever you'd have at this time. Oop. Okay, making a bit of a very tight pass. Uh, uh, come on. Okay, who's behind that? Is that a very automatic? And there go the lights. Okay, we're not getting through that. Yeah, could be automatic due to proximity alerts or something. Yeah, for being unsure if it's an asteroid or a like ship getting too close uh, to the uh, wrong areas. Yeah, micrometeorites are already a problem. They probably oh, yeah. be a problem still. Oh yeah, and of course the ship was approaching their damn windows. <laughs> really, shuttle boards? <laughs> ah, generator. Okay, good design to ha that they have some of these around, these backups. Okay. Open says Amanda. Uh, let's be honest, not having backups on a spaceship like this is just begging for more problems. And the games are out of, <laughs> out of function. Oop. Okay, that light was not sent to moving on its own. We just missed someone. Take that. Julia Jones, today's update. After numerous demands, Marsha Waits finally called a public meeting to address the rumors that have been circulating on Sevastopol. But instead of the answers we wanted, he continued to be evasive, and after only a few minutes, he and his team were pelted by projectiles from an angry crowd. A gun was fired, there was panic, and now Waits and what's left of his team are forcibly ejecting us from the terminal. Feels like we're on our own now. Oh, uh, great. Public unrest on top of everything else. Yeah, something indeed went wrong. Very smoky in here. It did some po uh, corruption happen? It's a, it's a movie in space from the 80s. Of course, there's corruption somewhere in the system. 
Okay. <coughs> Pulling the plug. Zoe, I'm sorry, but I won't need you to come in next week. As you know, the store has been in trouble for some time now, and I couldn't hold off the creditors any longer. There's just no one coming to Sevastopol anymore. It's just not us, either. It sounds like the whole station is in the, in the red, and they're pulling the plug. Going to sell it off for scrap, I guess. I was speaking to one of the engineers, and he reckons they'll announce it soon. I'm telling you this so you don't stick around looking for another job. Sevastopol's finished. Time to move on. Harper. I wanted to look into the shared folder as well. Okay. Well, yeah, since all of this tech is, well, chunky and old, well, old by our standards, uh, things take a bit of time to load around and such. To all spaceflight terminal employees, in the interest of public safety and the prevention of panic, it must be made clear to all potential passengers that there are currently no scheduled flights leaving Sevastopol nor ships available. The Colonial Marshals are investigating problems on station and will update accordingly. From the Office of Marshal Waits. Sounds like the place was under quarantine as well. And what is Apollo? Apollo is the central AI that monitors and provides guidance you know, for all, uh, yeah, all the Sikhs and working Joes on Sevastopol. Apollo also oversees all communications on the station. So wherever you are, you know you're in safe hands. Sikhs and tomorrow together. Okay. Oop. Safe station. <clears throat> yes. Mm. Oh. I didn't even notice that the first time. Okay, that shot's behind us. More shots, yeah. So the Colonial Marines were involved. No, not the not the marines, what? marshals. So more like uh, sheriffs. Oh, all right, they're that kind. I only see parts of this game, most of the beginning. I only to end up getting distracted by something else or not being in the mood. Hmm. But now. Definitely in the mood and doing it for stream, so finally will I be able to see the full game. And to join the Colonial Marshals, help us make our corner of the galaxy a safer place to you know, to travel, work, live. Okay, for a moment I thought that yeah, I thought it was a a URL. This whole damn place is falling apart. Gee, we didn't notice yet, Amanda. Gotta go through here. Oop. Pick that up. Guys, we are a blasted hoarder. I think we might want to take our leave ASAF ASAPFP as soon as fucking possible. Oh dear. I know you're afraid, Captain. Do me to kick the luggage around. <laughs> also, as you mentioned, this it may be made to a young scare counting. If we we'll young scare at all, yeah, we will see. Wait, <laughs> one. Okay, is it? This totally looks like just. I, I, are, the, are those actual shotgun shells? Because I thought... I th At first I thought they were shotgun shells, then I thought the lipstick, but no, it's fucking shotgun shells. Why do you put that up for advertising in here? Are you trying to get people to riot? Yeah, like... Uh, some areas I could understand, but on this space in particular? No. Okay. Let's see, anything behind this door? Bloody car driver! 
Okay, for a second I thought you were trying to jump scare me. Well, let's jump scare more of... What the heck was that? Two and a three. Come on, there we go. My Iki is going to suffer a lot in this game, I get the feeling. Your what? The Iki. On the keyboard. Oh! Anything else that can be accessed around here? Uh, very much doubt we can get through that, and... Uh, that's not a good sign, huh? Yeah, that's not a good sign at all. For a second I thought I saw someone up there. Is it to do that when you're... definitely getting paranoid? This is hard to not do get, uh, when playing games like these. If there's another one of those things. Another magazine. It's a workbench. That would be a good place to get into. Yeah, and what, what did you call your keyboard again? Keyboard. Uh, you said E key earlier. Yeah, the, the oh, E key on the keyboard. Because I need oh. to button mash it. Okay, okay, now I get it. I was wondering, what kind of weird nickname is that for a keyboard? I thought first you were talking about a new... What's it called? An anagram or... Acronym! Acronym! <laughs> acronym! Not an anagram. Acronym! That I, I thought you made a new... Talked about a new acronym I never heard of. I need a plasma torch for that. Okay, all sorts of sound all over the place from this place just falling apart. Or so we hope. Okay, but we can't do anything this way yet. We can't go that way. Medical equipment out here. Okay. Hmm. But it's off now. Just fitting the last security brace. Come find me when you shut yours down, and we can get the hell out of here. Jesus, man, I'm hearing noises everywhere. Every creak and... Just hurry the fuck up, will you? Okay. That's gotta be the exit up ahead. Yeah, but we can't mess with this. We need a maintenance jack. Or maintenance jail. Fuck the marshals. Yeah, this place was openly rioting. Looters will pay. More magazine? Was that a comic? Yeah, just another magazine. I think one of them was a comic. Let's see. Anything useful around any of this? And uh, yeah. Do I even need to explain? Yeah, time to go, uh, come out from your closet. No. <laughs> what? You're not gonna confess to your pirate? <laughs> okay, now what have we here except for... Well, exp <laughs> exploded Star Trek uh, consoles. That might have been who we saw earlier. What's this? Well, there's a save station and... Okay, nothing too important. Someone's family photo. Oh. I didn't mention One, a save two, station. Three. Yes. I like how the icon is just a cassette tape. <laughs> I'm not sure if that yeah. or a floppy disk would have been more, uh, better. Give me a second. 
Got a bug to smash. Two bugs okay. to smash. Actual living bugs. Uh, let's see. Uh, what was... Ban, timeout. There should be something to this. Just, uh, just straight up there. Oh, oh okay. Th this is nice. Uh, chat might be going, what the hell am I going on about? But it seems like uh, it seems that Twitch has wised up to these bots because they're not uh, showing to the they're not showing on chat. Okay, good one on that, Twitch. All right. So I was wondering, what the heck are you on about? I thought you actually talked about smashing bugs in real life. Nope. But yeah, uh, what's it? Oh, it's on the upside down weights. Uh, uh, Wade's lights was we saw, saw it before. Yeah, good on that for Twitch for deal. Or it's probably an easy deal because these bots all spout the same bullshit. Cheap viewers on insert random uh, link here, so they probably just put a ban everywhere on just on those lines. But yeah, we'll see how well they react to when the bot makers oop, chains up their attempts moonquake that's actually a book if i'm right calculator from the <laughs> control yes. hmm. in a way this for a second i thought something uh... oh, fuck. Uh, okay now this is evidence lock up this is the drunk um, okay. former drunk. Time to crawl around the air ducts. Now, in a way, this world could be somewhat compared to Fallout because it just got stuck in a certain era of uh, fashion and technology or style of technology and Okay, that can't be good. Yeah. So the data evolves in others very much. Yeah. Rulo, I want to make a complaint to the, the highest authority, okay? My name is Zachary Watson. That's Watson. You get that? My complaint is this. The fucking marshals. They should be protecting us. It's their job. Something's on the station with us, and no one knows what it is. No one fucking knows. They put braces on the doors. Locked down. You know, like to keep something out. I'm fucking terrified, man. I'm fucking... Shit. It's so cold. I don't think this fucking thing even works. ID tag. And I think we'll have more use for that. Yep. Okay. I think I need this more than you do. Yeah. Of many cipher tools, I like that one for they kind of make sense. As a multi tool. Okay. There. there is a hammer and a wrench. Okay. There. And that's how you remove that. Okay. Oh, also, let me make sure a bit... Okay, I banned both of those bots. Just wanted to make sure that I got... That I banned both of them. Didn't forget. Uh, okay, apparently the paper cups are haunted. Okay, deal with that. And open up that. Okay. Pretty simple. Let's see. Anything of use? Bonding Seems agent? Provided you have the tools. Yeah. Interview subject. Heist. Did I say that right? Heist? Look. If you can't even tell me your name, we're going to be here a hell of a long time. I 
just want to know about your boss. He's got you all into a lot of trouble. Someone's going to be accountable. I'm going to make damn sure someone's accountable. No? Tough guy, huh? Turner, turn off the tape. Maybe our friend here is just shy. Yeah, oh, great. Corruption. That's corruption. I'm honestly surprised not to see any dried blood, but they might have just cleaned it up. Okay. Or they didn't need to get bloody. Or, well, the, they moved the tape after they were done. Because, well... Oh. Yeah, that might be it. Go three lights. Oop. Give me a second. Getting cold for something. Okay. Okay, nothing big. Just uh, they, they just want to know if, if it, basic, uh, basically they want to go out for dinner to a new restaurant in the area. Romanian, oh. apparently. Okay. Let's take a look at that comic of yours. Because all of these look like ads to me. Okay, yeah, yeah that looks like ads. All right. It was just more colorful than the other one. Yeah, but it did have that 80 stylish, if you get what I mean. Yeah, very colorful. Yeah. Okay. It is. I can't tell if this place was first turned into a make, uh, makeshift hospital or morgue first. Though, of course, it could have started as a hospital and then became a morgue later. And originally... Well... Where you pick up your luggage. Yeah. Okay, let's open this up. What are these calls again? Hmm? What these are you jack? use? A jack. Yeah, the, the tool I'm using is called the maintenance jack. That's All right. sensor, scrap... Another sensor. And another bunch of ads. Okay, can't do anything with the tool bench, with the workbench itself. But still. Materials is materials. Consider how old this game is. It has aged well. I think, hmm. How old again is it? Like 10 years by now or such? Uh, about? Hmm. It, it just shows that you don't really need, like, hyper-realistic graphics. This is still very realistic, but this is about as uh, as realistic as I'd suggest people make their graphics. What is this? Northeast exit. Okay. A date? Hmm. Yeah, can I agree? For date? Where'd you come from? Ripley! Off station. A ship. There's no ships! Here! There are now. Well, huh, that's good news. Because things are not so good here. Something blew just now. Rocked this whole place! I saw it. But lady, that's the least of our problems. Yeah? Yeah. Something's on this station. Something you wouldn't believe. Like what? A killer. You get it? Okay. Okay.
What's your name? Axel. I was boarding with two colleagues. EVA. We got separated by the blast. Can you help me find them? Why? Because you seem to know your way around. No, I mean, why? What's in it for me? A place on the ship. How did I know I can trust you? I need to find comms. I need to contact my ship. This is your lucky day. Let's go, sweetheart. Seeks and comms is in the Sistex Bayer. It's quite a distance, but we can get to a transit through the freight area. But watch yourself. We can get into all sorts of trouble there, okay? Okay. Uh, I, I remember him. Probably. Yeah, yeah, you, 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 oh, Come on, I don't want to stick around here long. Then he wants us to get on with it as well. I would say, Red. reason I remember so well is to how Jacksepticeye reacted to him. I just thought he was a reference or something to him. And I know, he also, Stay more like, to me. oh, a federal Irish. And what the heck was that, a green hammer? Trouble. Who are you? I'm John. This is Ringo. You're just some assholes. We haven't got time for this. Come on, Jana. We're trying to get to comms. Can you help us? We don't need their help. Don't tell them anything. Look, I've got the elevator working. Jana, let's go, okay? I... I'm sorry. Good luck. What the hell was that about? Why are you so damn aggressive? Everyone's running shit scared, keeping to their own, safer that way. Yeah, I, I was going to say there's not much need for <laughs> trust when one has a fucking revolver and the other does not. Okay. I hope this ship of yours is the real McCoy. Okay. Is he following us or do we. Either way of saving here. Because uh, with the way his hand was shaking, not too sure he is too stable. And again, this entire place is unstable. Hold up. Let me get the elevator. Allow me. Place is old. Needs a special touch. Okay. Well, what are you waiting for? Hit the button. And there we go. And off we go. Keep the noise down here. There might be people around. I'd appreciate it if you told me what the hell was going on right now. Listen, now. When we get to the ship, we can kick back, braid each other's hair, and chat all you want. Yeah, when we get to my ship, I need to know what's going on right now. Fucking now! Fine. Like I said, there's a killer. A killer? What does that even mean? I ain't seen it, but it's here. Picking us off one by one. What are you saying? A psycho? A person? No. Something else. A monster. An alien, you may say. Yeah, so he's being awfully trustful of us with walking in front of us. Though I think he just heard that. Oh. Shit, we need to move. This way. Get down. This is bullshit, man. You should be looking for a way off. Are you crazy? There's no way off. At least we're safe down here. For how long? What if they come for us? Then we shoot the crap out of them. Now shut up. You're making me nervous. Always a bigger fish, or always a bigger caliber of gun. Trouble. We'll have to go around them. Follow me. Yeah, go. I was in the hill. After all the chaos that happened in then having that thing impressed the ship as well. 
friends of yours? I've had run-ins with those guys before. They don't like strangers, even nice guys like me. I'm shocked. I'm pulling your chain, darling. You want to go and say hello? It's your funeral. Those guns aren't for show. Sure. Someone should be doing something. They are. It's called surviving. Yeah, we all know where this is going to go. It wouldn't have alien in the title otherwise. I've noticed. Yeah, everyone will be on edge uh, with fear with a creature like that around. What can I say? My butler's on holiday. Grab what you need. You don't know when you'll get another chance. I think I already grabbed everything there was, and it was just a bit of scrap. Been hunkered down here for a week now, waiting for yep. a ship. Waiting for you, I guess. It can get pretty dark around here. You should take that flashlight over there. Flashlight? Make sure you're stocked up on batteries. Okay. Oh, it's a headset with a flashlight. Okay. Be careful not to flash it around. We don't want to get caught. Let's go. One safe station. Batteries. Yep. Okay, have to reload the batteries. Okay, okay no animation for reloading the batteries. So I wouldn't forget it. Okay. How about you look around? We're not going anywhere until you find that vent. I grab something. Batteries. Back into the transit station here. Let's see. I'm not seeing a mark there. This place gives me the willies. Back. Just a bunch of fucking cola cans all over. Oh. Hold on. I'm coming. <laughs> Where's one I actually get close to? I knew it was here somewhere. See? Got it covered. Anything else around here? Don't want to use too much of the battery. On, move your crazy ass out of the way. Those batteries go down fast. It's not smart to stay here too long. Technically, we could probably make a grab for his gun, like but everyone travels around here. Just those that want to stay alive, sweetheart. So that's your ship, huh? Quiet. I hear something. Yeah, I hear you. Will do. Gotta go meet the others. Something's going down. There's always something going down. Come on. We don't want to piss him off. We'll make it through this, I promise. Follow me. Like we have much of a choice. Three. Okay. Lento. Don't shine that flashlight. Lento say stations. Do they make sense? I don't think we need more supplies. What's the emergency? Someone else we can find. Everyone stay alert. Keep your guns tight. Shoot anyone you don't know. Stick around while I check our stock. They aren't. Too many of them to take on. Take on? We still got to get through there. The door at the end. How? Let's try a distraction. The 
generator. If that went down, they'd have to check it out. You're smaller than me. You'll make less noise. Great. Yeah. Which one of you checked our supplies last? I did. What's up? You decide to help yourself a little? What the fuck is that supposed to mean? Hey, he's been with me the whole time. We're missing food, ammo, meds. If it's not one of us, then we were right. Someone's been in here. This is no good. We're supposed to be secure down here. Damn it. What about the lock Joe rigged up? I've just come from there. Sealed tight. Eyes open. Keep your guns ready. Someone's gonna have to tell the boss. The boss? He's a goddamn store clerk. Yeah? Maybe you think you could do better. He's not saying that. I'm just saying that... Just stop saying. And help me check the rest of this stuff. That is, if you could keep your trap from running for five seconds. Okay, they'll come running to this, though. seem to be broken how would you know Einstein if the generator had blown there'd be smoke well it's not working now maybe the safety got tripped could have been a rodent got stuck in it set off the safety a rat big fucking rat to do that well I don't know someone is fucking with us probably the same person who stole our stuff that's a scary don't run you that's fucking that's why we've got guns. this way let's keep it down they're still close by follow me Okay, I thought he already slipped the fucks through and basically left us behind. Oh dear. And also, I thought the last one uh, to go by us but, uh, saw us for almost for a moment. Yeah. Okay. Yes. Okay. Yeah, you want me to go? Okay, fine. How much further? Nearly there. Transit's just up ahead. Let's just hope your ship's still there. Hello? So we're not quite what you're expecting, eh? I'm not even supposed to be here. My shipping out papers were for a week ago. And yes, the world does not stop when we're on these. A blind eye. I managed to get my hands on that stuff I was talking about. Chief won't even notice the stock missing. Things always get lost when the station's closing down. Don't worry about customs either. Sinclair's told his men to turn a blind eye. They'd probably be too busy goofing off or taking back handlers to notice anything. <clears throat> to notice anyway, they get what you pay for, I guess. There, there. Nearson, Leonard, you're both first shift on the door, so read carefully. Putting this together wasn't easy, and we don't want intruders getting in because you didn't read the instructions properly. This here is what you call a two-man rule lock. It mean, you know, that. This means it needs two to open the door simultaneously from two different consoles. Most of us don't know each other, so this is the safest way of making sure everything stays secure and none of us decide to head off on our own with our stuff. When you're on shift, take it in turns to keep guard and notify the other if one of us needs to be you know, let in or out. <clears throat> that means just us, no one else. No matter how much anyone begs and no matter what sob story they try and pull, I was in with a group before, and we got soft, and now I'm the only one left. Trust no one. Inventory. No one is to take anything or mark it off the list without talking to me first. Aspirin, canned food, cereal, water, toothpaste, cigarettes, toilet paper, industrial tape, med kits, and powdered milk. Running low on ammunition. Zoe meant to pick up some prescription drug and drugs, all addressed to the same person. Guess they didn't need them anymore. Okay, smarter than to keep a log of what they actually have. Us first again, it seems. Okay, they haven't figured out we've snuck by them yet. Oh, great. Let's power it down. The assholes have cut us off. 
We were the generator you got told it. us to. We need to open uh, both consoles at the same time to open it. I'll do this one. You go to the one on the other side. Okay. Or, or it's, <laughs> it's actually the airlock system. The, the two uh, lock system. Uh, let's see. Where is that other one? It's of course, the one not behind the glass. Ready. On three. One, two, three. Behind you. Yeah. Okay, looks like we found their guard, their doorman. You bums think you can take what you want? Get the fuck up! Fuck. Let's go. The others are on their way. We need to go! No! Hey, you bastards! Move okay, him. time to run. Shoot him! Shit, I think he's dead. They killed him. Come on! You killed that guy! Because he was going to kill me, you saved my life. This is about survival. Do you understand? Here's something. Now we have a friend loose in the station. I keep moving. See what I mean, folks? That on a highly populated ship, taking and, and killing people one by one. Yeah. <clears throat> Along with corrupt marshals. And you have this. <clears throat> I have my voice there. <clears throat> you might want to check your throat for. Uh... Any uh, base hugger residue, I guess. Okay, what do we I'm need to press fine. Here? Up there. I thought it was just another one of these lights. the place okay there we go Ooh. all right also, what do you mean accurate in direction you're facing so what do you mean about about face hugger residue because, well, they tend to stuck, <laughs> stuff stuff uh, th down people's throats. Actually, that's going to make the next time we stream with this quite hilarious. <laughs> For now... Well, what are you on about? Station service. Are you telling me? Technologies, tech support services, and Gemini Exoplanet Solutions. I think maybe we did not eat chicken yesterday. Okay, let's see what's up here first. Access tuner, okay. 
bunch of tools that we don't have yet. And an inactive elevator. Okay. Oh, we can deal with that though. Someone else was not able to. Scrap and a med kit. I probably should use that. Oh, okay. Click here to craft. Okay, we need... To, okay, we need to... It wasn't that we didn't have stuff. It's we need to allocate stuff to be able to craft it. And we need to scrap the... <clears throat> We also need scrap to actually be able to make it. Okay. That might have been overkill, but better to be hale and hardy than to be well stabbed through the chest. Yeah, okay. and I should remember, we'll be streaming this again tomorrow. Yep. Yeah. Uh, thank you to follow Lisa. <laughs> or Lisa's. <laughs> Hope you'll enjoy the show. Okay, bunch of hiding spots around here. Actually, no, this is just where we started earlier. So I just got myself turned around. Okay, let's try the other side then. Also, let's try this. Yeah. Maybe may say, why are there so many shake points? Take note, this is emergency. They use them as a save point, makes sense, and they will be all over a ship like this. Yeah. Because you, you don't want to have to run across half a station to get a fucking fire extinguisher. You don't want to do that. Yeah, you don't want to have to do that with emergency contact either. Indeed. You want to have a swift access to just run, call emergency if there's an emergency. Over oh here. Locks. And I think I'm gonna refill my pint. So, Captain? I think you know the drill at this point. Yeah. No promises. <laughs> For people the people new here, whenever I walk away from the computer, I just say, don't die. And... Yeah, this is good. Stay back! Shit! Oh, great. That's locked. That's also locked. That's a swing and a miss, quite literally. Is there oh really dear. no other ways. Wait, I'm not gonna drink now. Okay, where the hell does this go? Down. Okay, where the hell is this? Injector, scrap, and flare. Okay, but the rest of this is locked off. Oop. Revolver ammo is single freaking bullet. Okay, always good to save one for yourself in desperate situations, but we don't have a revolver to go with it. Okay, now where did that trigger happy one run off to? That's locked. That is just broken or something because no lights are on. Yeah, simple understandings. Green or red means closed. But there's also something we can do with that. What's this? Rewire. Okay, use rewire to toggle systems on and off in your surrounding area. Systems share a limited power supply. Switching systems off will provide the power to switch others on. Study the map on the right and yeah, on the right hand screen with mouse to check the position of local systems. Access new areas, create, di uh, create diversions, and experiment with Sevastopol systems to help achieve your goal. Yep. Uh, let's I'm see. Back. 
Are you with me, Captain? Okay, there's only one power here. What if there's an unstable system behind us? Okay. There's the speaker sense in the system in the middle. An air purification here. There's no other rooms here. Oh, and... Okay, that seems to have turned off air purification. Okay. At least that'll uh, offer some pockets where we can hide a bit better, I guess, if we don't cough up a lung. Speaking of coughing up lungs... Uh, restore power... Okay, do we need to turn that on? Hmm. Okay, why is it when we turn the air purification on that it's... <laughs> oh, well. That unstable system is on the other side, though. Or, wait. Okay, now I'm confused. Or did we... I, I think we just coughed up a ton of... Uh, a ton of dust out of the system by turning the air purification back on. That's locked. The hell did they run? They're yeah, honestly probably best that, yeah. that they're far away from us. Hmm. Okay, what can we screw with here? Okay. Seems okay. Air purification here as well. And again, that unstable system. Hmm. Okay, is that unstable system blocking this door or something? Hmm. We don't have a map of the area, I'm pretty sure. I need to keep an eye out for those map terminals also. Keep an eye out for these little things. Okay, good thing I noticed those. Hmm. Any more of those rewire things around? Okay, for, mo for the moment I think I need to cut off all of those unstable systems. Or just cut all the power from them. Hmm. Where do we need to go then? Or wait. I think I actually remember a thing now. Do we need to... In yes, we need to interact with this first. She was trying to hack the elevator security. Circuits are fried. Easy fix. Just need to find a new data set. Okay. Do loudly declare where you're heading. See yet? What was that? Ah, crap. I might have been spotted there, so I might need to whack this guy over the back of the head. We'll see how how well they check their corners. Or they just go the other way, it seems. Seeks in synthetic. The artificial person you can recognize and trust. Okay. Okay, he... Ooh, fuck. 
Okay, I thought for a second he was actually smart enough to go, nope, I'm not checking that the fuck out because then I'm getting at my ass bitten off. Okay, they can't see us when we're peeking. Or they probably can if we're peeking, peeking out too much. How you holding up? You okay? I get the feeling the moment we move forward, they turn around. Yeah, going by his footsteps, he definitely was. Okay, was not expecting it to be literally fucking walls. there. Shh. What was that? Oh! It was nothing. How did we do that? I'd almost say blind fucking luck, but it's more than likely that he's blind. <laughs> Fill this place up with smog. It'll help hide us a bit better. Okay. Hey. Still want to break line of sight as best as possible. Hmm. Okay, so one last thing on that air, quote unquote, purification. Part of me thinks it is just coughing up all of the dust collected in them. Or we're just spraying the place with a cleaning agent. And uh, that's not good. That's not good at all when your ship is losing bullshit. Okay. Not going that way. Hey, Wait, do you. She went downstairs. Come on. Will you want. going down there. No way. She's got your hack tool. It didn't work. We'll find another way out. We've been here too long already. I'm not hearing footsteps, so I'm not sure if they're actually coming down or not. All the same, we keep moving. Okay, maybe there's a reason they don't want to get down here. I don't think this flare is going to help us much with self-defense. Really, just one of those fucking things? Wait. What? Oh, give me that. Oh. Oh, hello. And it's actually loaded. Someone made a big mistake leaving that behind, and now we're talking about this thing here. Uh, wait, hold on. Is that a red button? I don't think it can actually reach it. Okay, I'm thinking it more like a light than a button. Yeah, I hope it's a light, but I think they, are, like, they, may, they could not resist to make that joke. <laughs> there. Not heading that way, I think. What's making that noise, that chattering like? Hmm. Okay, it looks like they haven't chased us down here. I'm guessing this connects to the other entry point. Yep, it's just around the corner. I'm actually turning my bloody head when I'm looking around like this as well. Hello. Either that's set to automatically track people or there's someone on the other side of that. 
Beware of bag theft. I think we have a bigger thing on our... A bigger thing to deal with now. Yeah. Uh, I think I know a uh, good way to deal with that camera. How then? Well, you could give it the evil eye. <laughs> okay, disconnect Should back be... to the other two. Wait, Wait what? I doubt the other two would dare to crawl into these spaces. And it connects back to the other two uh, oh, item maxed scrap. Okay. Oh, take all. Okay, we're maxed out on scrap and sensors. Uh, anything we can. Uh, let's see. Okay, we can only carry a maximum of all of those. Uh, we can't make flares. Hmm. Okay. I guess we leave that behind. And yeah, here's the other entry points. Okay, hiding spot there. Hmm. Okay, where do we go then? Deeper down? Heading deeper underground, deeper under station. Hmm. What was that song? Heading deeper underground? The song? No, it's a lyric of a song. A partial lyric at that. And okay. Nothing here. Now I'm curious on that song, so I may, may try to look up that one later tomorrow. Hmm. I don't remember anything about it, really. Other than that being a partial lyric. We're going or heading deeper underground. That sounds... That rings a bell, actually. I don't know where I heard it either, but... It should be able to be oh. found on YouTube. Okay, I thought we needed a, something else for that. Okay. A note paper. ID tag... People have really been smoking up a storm on this station, and for good freaking reason. Yeah, do I was say ash trays have become more and more rare. Yeah. Then many places this like bloody heck, when I was younger the world, they were bloody common restaurants, but now they are basically non-existent. You probably can still ask for one, but they aren't on desk standard. And hello. Yeah, you would have to be forced to smoke outside, like uh, the outdoor uh, tables. If any. Flashbang version one. Okay. Oh, and tab is for the map. Oh no, okay. something's One, off. two, three, four, and then the head. Someone really wanted this guy dead. Hold on, look at him closer. Something's off. I don't... I very much doubt those are chest burster holes, because they're a bit too small for that, but those are oh, no. big holes for bullets. Yeah, uh, all right, uh, so the pod under him was red, so... All right, so he was not a synth uh, then. From the blood on the shirt looked... We... Was it really red? Oh, God. The flight recorder. What? And the whole reason we're here. Oh, great. 
And now we're locked in here. With a lot of noise being made. Okay, there has to be some way to get out of here. Okay, why is this thing green? Oh, that's why. Uh, okay, why are we doing this? Is there something behind this? Oh, data cell. Okay, that's what we need. Okay, swap out the battery. Okay. It's no signal. Uh, tune with mouse and move keys. E to enter code shown. Uh, there we go. Uh, there, there, and there. Okay. Okay, so that's how the hacking works. Mouse first. And then... Yeah, just... Fix the code. Okay. There. V. That. And that. Okay. I've heard that people really dislike this minigame. So far, so good. Also, rather swanky. Must have been someone's office here. Full on bonding agent. Your know, blast were flashbangs. We need blasting caps. It... Okay, for a moment I thought I saw movement out there, but fucking dust bunnies in the air. Thank you for that mental image. <laughs> okay. Almost scared myself there. Are you feeling on edge, Captain? Yes. Kind of the point of this game. Oh, really? I thought it was, it was a relaxing game. <laughs> yes, people, I'm being sarcastic. Give me a break. Yep. And now we are locked in as well. And yes, there is a reason that I'm keeping an eye on the vents when I pass by. There. That. That. And that. I get the feeling we're going to get longer codes or shorter times to deal with that. Okay, what have we here? Uh, to Chief W. Chief Porter, Sevastopol Terminals. Chief, the good news is that I'm about 80% through archiving Sevastopol's internal mail system from the decommissioning. It's been disconnected from Apollo, but I've left the basic messaging system in place for the people still here. The bad news is whoever set it up in the first place skimmed on the hardware and we've had m some leaks. I've got Mike Tanaka looking into it now. He's a specialist archivist we called in. Seems to know his shit. Just thought I'd better give you a heads up in the meantime. Okay, an outpost of progress number one. Uh, desolation through isolation. The space station that nobody needed, run by a company we all forgot. Sevastopol is now a backwater. The population is a tenth of the station's optimal capacity. Docking bays are empty and the shutters are down on local stores and businesses. The orders for a season's cheaply manufactured androids have long since dried up and the antiquated Apollo governing AI in the system frequently malfunctions. How do we get here? And more importantly, where have billions of dollars of the investment gone? My name is Julia Jones. I have lived on Sevastopol for two months, compiling this report for the Colonial Times, discovering the price our second-tier corporations have paid for their over-expansion during the race into the Outer Rim. Okay. No audio and no utility. Oh, so this space station has been for a long while... Claim to use a lot of money, but it's very obviously Vince Sheep on it. Yeah, okay. 
Put a sensor in that. Some bonding also, agent. I have someone in chat, Captain. Uh, hello there, Necro, a king of previously Pika. No! no. Pizza! No. <laughs> Why did I immediately jump to Pika? <laughs> so you love the new outfit. Also, hi, how are you? Doing pretty good. Uh, thank you about the outfit. It's just a temporary one for Spooktober, of course. Or just someone smashed a pumpkin over my head and it gave me red eye as well. Okay, craft a flashbang. Okay. We need to shut this freaking alarm up. Another bullet. Okay. Well, where do I shut this off? Oh, here. And yeah, now he is actually loose. Oh. Here, he vanished right up another fucking vent immediately. How okay. it looks grumpy. <laughs> okay, let's just get the hell out of here. Now that the lockdown's gone. Okay, come on. Nothing here. Where's the Actually, fucker? I don't ask question to you, Captain. Who? Does they look like a Harold or a Greg? <laughs> He looks like a uh, get the fuck out of here. <laughs> now we can actually. Oh, hello. Now he's actually loose, or it's actually loose. And yeah, now we are being hunted. Uh, I've been being hunted for a while. You, you remember what happened to Axel? Yeah. But now we can actually run into him and meet the same fate. So... Okay. Yeah, I think I remember people saying there was a little bit... Death scenes? I just don't remember how many. There we go. Just going through them left to right. Okay. think firearms are going to help much against him, huh? And he's actually heading the way we need to... Well, I think you can kill them with firearms. Just unsure about, about... These revolvers do look rather heavy duty. Yeah, in the uh, other games, yes, but in this game, uh, it's more giving it a minute. 
Yeah. No, his uh, other problem, uh, I think we all, most of us know, is uh, a bad idea when shooting aliens on a spaceship. Acid. Blood. Yeah. And whatever you do, don't blow it up. Or at least not when you're in the splash zone. Oh, definitely not when you're in the splash zone. Or, yeah, but I, I would not be surprised if that's happened. You blew it up too close to a window. Yeah. Because that acid is going to eat through, and then you have the vacuum of space to deal with. Yeah. Oh, this is from remember this from one of the movies. I think the one the there was the fourth movie. Yes, they are actually smart enough to sacrifice one of their own to you make use of their bloods melting through something. And yeah. Androids. I think at the one point. Hello, my name's Ripley, Amanda Ripley. I need your help. Please take a seat. Someone will be with you shortly. No wonder Seatson is losing the tech race. Yeah, they they went to Uncanny Valley. And took a slide down the, right down to the middle of it. Okay. Oh dear! But yeah, I think it was another scene. Where I feel like it dropped a uh, something dropped the blood, and they investigated how far it went, and it went like, it was like four, ten floors or something. So of one a long drop ass of blood. way. Yeah, well, that, I think that was for one drop of blood, or at least one small splatter of blood or something. Let's see, what can we screw with? Let's see, air purification. Oh, that takes three power, okay. The whole network... Okay, that's quite a bit more here, then. Oh, dear. Uh, oh, oh, no, there's more rooms that we can access. And as I remember, I don't remember how... Like, again, spread them along with a lot of floors. I have no idea how much an entire body does. Probably quite a bit more. That needs a key card. Needs a torch. Yeah. Uh, okay, also, here's a random fact. For uh, something I've done this when growing up. Whenever they show, uh, had uh, moments. Let's see. Make your way to comms. Hmm. Go ahead. Okay, with AI, but over there. Uh, yeah, I meant in game there. Uh, what was I would say? Oh yeah, whenever they were they were to do show all alien movies on the channel, they showed one, two, and four. Yeah, because people don't like three. Yeah, when I learned of that, I thought, wait, what? Why are they say the alien field game? But they, when, I need to get into the comms control. It's urgent. That is a restricted area. It's an emergency. Don't you realize what's going on? Apollo has the situation in hand. Your registration is almost complete. Forget it. I'll find my own way in. I think three had something to do with clones or something. Uh, no, the clone was in the fourth movie. Yeah, a bunch of these androids around. And I, I actually own the third movie. Okay. I own the third movie on DVD and. I thought it was all right, and they did explain to me, well, what the heck the fourth was about. But I always thought, okay, the fourth movie is awesome, but it was felt weird for, I thought it was the third movie. I felt like, is this continuation from one of the games or something? But no, it was actually, it was actually the fourth movie. Return. Okay, nothing um, really to screw with, or nothing useful to screw with, I'd say. I will say this, though. 
Well, I do find odd. Says, uh, says I again have seen the third and fourth movie. How the heck do they make a clone from when she threw her seam to molten metal? Hello there. Some kind of tracker. It's been modified. Yeah, now we have a little toy to tell us if there's movements nearby. No, no problem. Okay, I, I like I like that everything else loses focus. Because well that's likely where we'll be watching most. Oh that actually turned on the power as well. Or did Joe turn on the power, I guess. Uh, let's see. Hughes, I've put a manual lock on the door leading upstairs. Don't want any accidents until we figure out what's going on here. Chief. Uh, not permitted. Our manifesto. First published in Ion Season 2115. We don't want to show you a new world. We want uh, to discover it with you. Here at Seekson, every new technology research project and discovery is driven to find real uh, world applications to help you. We hope you'll join us for the journey. Okay. Oh, and <laughs> yeah, Necro's been talking. Uh, Pika is crazy. It was pizza. Yeah, three is considered a bad and unlucky number here. I'm just gonna look now. Okay. Uh, tomorrow we're together. Uh huh. 2034 changed everything. The advent of faster than light travel put Siegson, then known as Siegen Sun, on the path to success. The race into space began in earnest, and under the steady hand of our founder, Josiah Sieg, our company was primed and ready for the years that followed. Sieg and Sun built the components that enabled ships to extend colonial space beyond the solar system. As history relates, Wayland Corp. was reluctant to share its FTL technologies with other corporations. Fortunately, Josiah Sieg was on hand to speculate, innovate, and produce. Without Sieg and Sun, the skies would have looked very different indeed. Okay, so a pioneer in FTL tech. Oh, hello. Marie, if you get this, I'm making my way to Seeks and Communications now. I didn't wake you because I knew you'd try and stop me. <laughs> Please understand, this is our best shot. Someone's got to re-establish communications. We need to make sure the officials back at home know what's going on here. <laughs> Don't worry about me. I'll be back. I'm not going to leave you and Claire alone. Okay. And, yeah, door access. Open that right up. Uh, for people who don't know, FTL, if I remember right, is faster than light. Yeah, it did say it out the long. It did say it in the long form earlier as well. Okay, yeah, it's been too it... quiet. Too quiet, Captain. We're on a spaceship, not a forest. Yeah, there's... Oh, damn it. The, the, the alien's been away too long. Or the xenomorph, if you want the long name. Yeah, they're called xenomorph in-universe. Yeah, really? We can hide in this? Okay. Get rid of this thing. It so makes sense, one but... Box behind them. Come on. Okay. Hiding that box makes sense. Just, I agree. It's usually a closet. Yeah. Let's or see. under no, a There's bed. a bunch here. And showers. Mm. Amanda could probably use one right now, but... Mark on the edge of the motion tracker. Okay, that's useful. That way we don't need to put up uh, the map all the time. Noisemaker. Some scrap. Let's see. Charge pack, a sensor, and an injector. Okay. And just a little lounge, I guess. And I remember something that I was confused by a lot over the years and on the show where the heck that this thing started is about the xenomorphs. No. 
for some reason, Aris told me, and even I thought for it very well, that White Cinemas comes from those facehuggers as well. But it's also told that the, the you know, the infamous tongue of a Cinemoth also can infect someone with a facehugger? I very much doubt that. Yeah, I think I like that's been proven wrong over the years, but somehow that became a thing. But then again, that was before YouTube videos and all that. Mm. Let me in. I need to contact my ship. There's gotta be another way inside. Okay, how? Okay. She's. Amanda's probably wearing some sort of uh, infrared tag or something. Yeah, there's probably like a tag in her costume, in her outfit, that can be scanned. Okay, there. There, okay. Different minigame. Okay, where the heck? Okay, someone make, made a sort of blueprint in 3D. I'll take those. A moment, I mistook the familiar Falcon. No materials to be moved from site, misappropriation or unauthorized removal of company resources result in immediate termination of your train. Is that supposed to be a magpie? Yeah, it's a species of magpie. Yes, they come with different variants. With different patterns. Let me pass. It's me, Hughes. Don't you recognize me? Listen to me. We've got to re-establish long-range communications. You're becoming hysterical. Get back! I'm warning you! Tut, tut. This is all this has to be. We've got rogue androids on our hands as well. Rogue or worse? What, AI uprising? Oh, that actually would be worse, but... Um, you remember the first movie? Oop, oop, gets it. How far does that go? Uh, what about the first movie? I think someone may have a thing control of the AIs to make sure certain, in their word, asset survives capture. We'll if that makes see. sense. And where did that go go? Yes, gate access avoids detection. This back where we were early? No, this is not. Okay. The scrap. Let's see. Uh, sensitive corporate information has been automatically detected in a Sylvester link message recently sent from this terminal. This event has been logged by Apollo on behalf of Seeks. And if you need further questions. Okay. And I'm guessing that was this message or whatever that was. Apollo's eye. Right, so he's still working down in Seeks and communications. Remember the trouble that you got into last year, the trouble I helped you out of? But Sundry paid a favor. One of my colleagues has been looking into some of the import documents and found a few problems. He's new, so he doesn't understand how we do things in Sevastopol and he's threatening to go to waits about it. This could hurt us all, so I need you to keep an eye on him. See if anything interesting comes up. Apollo has cameras everywhere, bleh, everywhere. it just needs someone to tell it where to point to. His name is Daniel Hal uh, Haldin. Lives in Josiah Sig Executive Apartments 651. 
If this goes well, it might have some. Yeah, I might have some more work for you. We could clean it up. Ran, fitting name. Okay. Well, now we have. Let's mess with this. Okay, let's see. Camp. We're turning that off immediately. That stays off as well. And, yeah, let's just smoke up the place a bit then. Okay. We may be able to see less, but so is all our opposition. Hopefully. The Xenomorph doesn't have eyes, so it sees through some other methods. I'm going to need to rewatch about Xenomorphs again to remember much of their known biology. As long as, it does, not canon. as long as it doesn't see in thermal, we should be okay. Also, we could just slip on their desks like this. Yeah, and I should also say to people, so for you, I will not be surprised that that has happened in the comics, but you don't want any Xenomorphs near any zoo. Yeah. If you wonder why, here's the thing. When they infect a person, they we use the host DNA to form into the xenomorph. Hence, and when they infect a human, these are the very that comes out. And if they infect something else, it will be a bit different. Yeah, I, I, you, I hear those runners, the speedy fox. I hear those are supposed to be from when they uh, come from dogs and such. Yeah, what was supposed to be? Were not supposed to be appear. Supposed to have been appeared in the third movie, but they changed that. I think. And yeah, worst case scenario would be if they get their hands on a predator, because then you get a oh. predalien. Oh, do oh, Captain, you sweet innocent Captain. What? Uh, there's been worse things for them to infect. Like what? Alligators. Elephants. Rhinos. Okay. Uh, you think about out. it. Like, Xenomorph infected human is one thing. Infected predator is another thing, but... When we go to something like... Really big animals? Yeah. So you do got a question how the face hugger fits on those then. Well. Probably want to head up here. Oh dear. Yeah, the pet with animal they shouldn't be too hard. But if it's an animal with really, really big mob, then it'd be harder. And somehow people thought the idea of making fan of a scene move T-Rex was a good idea. Nightmare fuel people. Nightmare fuel. Something I remember, I don't think I've ever, I don't think it has ever happened in the, uh, in the movies, but, hmm, but supposedly, actually probably best if I keep, uh, <laughs> hmm. yeah, supposedly there's ways that uh, xenomorphs can make more eggs without a queen or something. Yeah, that's okay. 
Uh, that rings a bell. I think that they can do that under certain circumstances. Gotta be someone in the station I can contact. Great. Long I range is out. I'm probably gonna start watching Cinema more for lore videos at, uh, tomorrow and all that. All of those are maxed. Okay. Okay, we got a good amount of revolver ammo now. Yeah, let's see. Sensor. Injector. And I just remember where the alligator xenomorph came from. We probably should make a few of these. <sighs> For people wondering, the alligator xenomorph came from uh, a Batman crossover. I thought so. I think that's also where the crocodile ones are from. Well, if it's a crocodile xenomorph, then yes. In fact, a, a, a wait, oh yeah, wait, no, it would be an alligator in this case. It says Americas. Uh, North America, they have alligators there, but crocodiles. So yeah, it would be an alien gator. Yeah. And yeah, it fell into a swamp, infected a gator. And yeah. Uh, that one, that one, that one. Okay. And if I'm right, it was huge. Okay, logging in. Torrens Hill. This is the commercial vessel Torrens out of St. Clair, registration calling Sevastopol. Yeah, traffic control, we're carrying three passengers. Okay, so that was what we sent out earlier. Operation not permitted. This is Verlaine on the Torrens. What the hell just happened? Sevastopol! Oh. Did any of our EVA team make it on board? Please respond. Okay, this is what we we'll what, yeah, what we just heard. And are pulling out of Sevastopol space. Systems will be down while we repair. I can't say for how long. And this is what we were supposed to hear through all of the static, I presume. This Sevastopol station. We have a serious situation here. Non-local comms are down, and we need you to send out an emergency message. Do you read me? Repeat. Our ranged communications are down, and we need help. Stand off and send help. Yeah, it would have been rather good if we heard that instead. If it was a fuck ton of static. Okay. So that is of no use to us. Yeah, we just we need to find something else. Okay, luckily we don't need batteries for this thing. Also, just because there's no blips doesn't mean there is isn't anything. Because it only detects motion. Yeah. And as you can see, it has a bit of a limited range because there's definitely something, you know, one of those Joes there. We just can't didn't reach it. Okay. Oh, hello. Oh, for love of... What? For a split second for that thing on the wall was uh, the forehead of the xenomorph. For a split second. Some, something's messing with the scanner. Okay. So things can mess with the scanner. Internal communications. That's probably where we want to go. Oh, open up, well, open. Okay, that's not fun to have that just locked behind my back. Okay. Yeah, this is actually. Okay, this is either the monitoring hall or internal com uh, comms. Either way, it's a wave. 
from that creepy fuck. Even employee rec rec the recreation. Oop. What? What is? What was that? For, what was the scanner reacting to there? Something near us. Probably not the brightest idea to go looking what the hell this is. Hello? Is anyone there? Anyone it's a Joe. Don't know if it saw me there. Okay, it's definitely heading this way. Okay, it's heading away. Okay. Nothing else nearby, according to the scanner. Okay, all of these consoles have been covered up. Uh, let's see here. Oh, uh, press matching key? What? When the circuit is... Okay. okay, the one that isn't, doesn't have a dot. Okay. Uh, use right and left right to balance. Uh, enter to confirm. Oh, they, they match the other side. Okay, uh, value. Uh, okay, we need to catch some of. Okay. This was a weird one. Samuels! You're alive! It's Ripley! Ripley! Taylor, it's Ripley. We were getting worried. We I thought... made it! Where are you? Uh, we're at the transit station now. It's right by medical. Okay. Samuels, listen to me. It's not safe here. Siegson's got this place locked tight. Their goddamn androids are killing people! That's impossible. It's contrary to primary synthetic programming. I've seen it, Samuels. I guess Siegson's got a different idea about synthetics. And there's something else here. A creature. It's big and it's lethal. Ripley, slow down. A creature. It's a life form. A, an unknown type. Some kind of alien organism. It's extremely dangerous. You and Taylor Ripley, need to make... Taylor is hurt. She was injured by debris during the crossing. How bad? I can't move her. I need medical supplies. We need to treat and pack the And injury. the Torrens? The radio is broken. I can't contact Verlaine. We're on our own. Shit. Okay. I'll come to you. Keep your eyes open. I'll send a transit car to you. Oh, great. Oh, on come on! EMP. Bonding. Okay, time to fuck with the local systems. Uh, okay, first, we turn that off. That we turn off, and that we... Okay, there. That, that, and that. Okay, that'll have to do. Oh. 
there. Okay, I, I, yeah, so this. I do like that this does point in there. If you're not looking towards something, it does point to uh, activity to, well, where you're not pointing. Oh dear. Like I said, this. Anyone who watched them all movies will probably be paranoid near any events. Yeah. Speaking of, I probably should keep an eye on those overhead vents. Ooh. Not the best time to do this, but okay. Yeah, not. Yeah. Sebastopol, this is Wayne Yutani, Executive Administrator Nina Taylor, confirming receipt of your transmission. I'm a member of the team assigned to collect the Nostromo flight recorder. The black box in your possession is of primary importance to Wayne and Yutani. Under existing corporate agreements, we should remind you that you must not attempt to read its contents, nor disclose its presence to any third parties. We'll be with you soon. A private message from Marshal Waits will follow. Okay. Wait. Did they sit in Waits? No, Waits was already here. Or I suppose... And yeah, those are... <laughs> Emergency uh, or alert lights. Also, uh, what kind of name is Waits? But really? Well, anything Waits? can be a name, really. For a matter of fact, uh, my first name is a misspelling and a rather big one at that, and I'll say no more of that. Let's hope that these don't wake up. GNR interrupt engaged. <laughs> Fucking radio. <laughs> yeah, I'm not playing here, but I mean, I am nervous. Hey, what the motherfucker? Okay, the bastard things can play dead. Did, did you just get jump scared? A bit. What? First jump scare? I surprisingly did not get jump scared. And I'm surprised by that. Uh, let's just go around. There's one. The fuck off evil red eyes helps make them easier to spot when they're looking your way. Which is, well, not the way that you want them to look. And it doesn't help that these things can stand as still as corpses. Is this even... Is this the general direction that we need to go? This is Central Communications. Seeks and employees only. Ooh. It's one of the chrome domes. I don't know if we can sneak attack them. There's a lot of activity around us. Whatever's on the other side, that's where we're heading. Not that way, though. Yeah, the vent... These thick walls interfere with the motion detector. Okay, where'd he go? There he go. Of course, it closes behind me again. Yep. 
liquid seeks and there's someone's behind you. Not what we want to hear at the moment, of course. Open, open, open. Okay. So are those three... I don't know if these things patrol set parts or if they just go wherever the hell they want. If these... If they, sit, if they patrol uh, a set route, he'll... Yep. And go back there, yes. Okay. We need time to just get out of here. Another one. Locked. Risking it. Really? Okay, that's not the way we need to go, actually. Okay. Well, we'll have to wait for that Joe. Yeah, there is Joe. Okay, I almost thought he was moving forwards there. Why did I suddenly think about sloppy Joe? <laughs> yeah, if we can, if we can find ourselves a mug and chuck it at one, we, they can have. We can have ourselves a cup of Joe. No, no, no. Just nope. Of the uh, no a certain SCP coffee machine. Just nope. <laughs> just a, a cop of uh, whatever the first name on these things. He went back there into the other one. Okay. Yeah. Actually, I think that happened. Someone tried to order a cup of you, and probably is that yeah, what actually just happened to be the person's first name. And yeah, I, I know that being, thing. It has a sense of humor. It is humor or misunderstood. Or they made a ban of uh, any drink slang. Just actual, very specific with the names. For the machine is very specific. Yeah. So, yeah, when you write a couple of you, they think, oh, you want a cup of yourself all right we take a bit of your organs here and there yeah you see the problem yeah though it will it if i recall correctly it's supposed to have some self-preservation uh instincts quote unquote as in it, if it'll actually help uh deal not deal with uh we need that well, if you mean it, that it will provide help. medical supplies as well. Yeah. Or medical liquids. And out. Uh, okay. Um, Captain, look at the poster. Uh, next to you, no, oh, no, behind you. <laughs> Seriously? <laughs> Uh, well, we're not out of the woods yet. We just spoke about it, and us. After what are the odds? Not, me not high. Uh, we talked about it is a peer, but no why not to order a cup of yo? And what do we see shortly after? Cup of yo. A poster yep. about cup of yo. For love of all. Yeah, at least it's not Cotton Eye Joe. Captain? <laughs> then I wonder what the hell that thing would give if you order the <laughs> a mug of Cotton Eye Joe. Captain? Either you'd get cotton or you'd get a, a, you'd get a liquid that somehow plays the song. Captain, careful. I still have the note here about a certain spell. I think you know which one. <laughs> yeah. I guess not doing it this time for... Uh, it's late. I don't think I can pronounce all these words properly at the moment. Yes. Mm. Is this actually... Okay, now we need to go... Do we need to go down and then that way? 
I can hear it in the vents. Okay, this is the way we need to go. And that's a Joe. I'm probably missing stuff, but... Uh, let's turn that off, turn that off. There and there. Okay. Again, this puts us at a disadvantage, but also puts them at a disadvantage. Plus, we have this. They don't. And this is Hands. a bit of a dent. But we, we know this all low budget sheep side androids or synthetic. Mm -hmm. But they uh, still might have something that allows them to see through this better than us, for all we know. Maybe. Most likely not, but still. Where are they? There's something very close to us. Oh. Wait, what's, what's that spiky motherfucker in that vent just before me? Hmm? Uh... We're Necro, we saw Mark earlier here. Yep. They were, they were at the start of the stream. And they ran out of the Ritus in mere five minutes or something. Less so, I think. I mean, really wonder how the heck did they eat? Was it a tiny bag or? Could be that it was a tiny bag. Yeah, they're not big to be begin with, and they do come small. Like, oh, wait, what? Yeah, thoughts. Oh, oh, we can open these from the other sides. Okay. Okay, that's a shortcut up and down. Then we need to get around stuff. Okay, I can hear the Joe. I think. Uh, Xenomorphs nearby as well. Two targets. Three? Okay. That's the Xenomorph either getting in or out of a vent, I think. Oop. That's the top. So not that. Get out of the... Okay, but was that supposed to be a Joe seeing us or something? Or... You know, I'm sure. I nope. the... Pretty sure one of them is coming towards us there. I saw them staring dead at us. Yep, that's, that's a line of they spotted us. Those two Mets. Are those two Joes or. Yeah, two Joes. Get in. Oh, incoming. No.
Okay, we need to get through this corridor. The Joes gave up. Okay, there's one Joe. Not much of a hiding space. No. How about you follow me into this, Mr. Can't Bend My Knees? Yeah, indeed, it was, this was not a good hiding place. Or oh, that place wasn't. Okay, there's two Joes in the room ahead of us. Uh, let's see. Necro, I see. Did you guys tell him about my rebrand and effectively my previous Discord account? Uh, yeah. Yeah, did not tell that actually. Um, uh, all right. Um, there should there should be a button or something below the stream that that should give you an invite to the Discord server. Uh, otherwise, you could try and DM me, and I'll I'll be able to send you an invite then. Not sure if we've been here yet. If there's loot, it probably means we haven't. Let's see. Corrupted. Oh, right. sweet innocent necro. The perfect androids one. are not the perfect life form. No, that's Shadow the Hedgehog. <laughs> What's going on up there? I've been waiting for a call and. Please stand by, your call item is being rerouted. Hello, more working Joe's acting strangely. It won't listen to anything called being rerouted. I need help. I'm trapped in my apartment. There's an android outside and... Okay. Put me through the marshal's office. It's an emergency. Someone uh, Something's wrong at my store. Uh, he's gone. It, it killed him. I think... Right, yeah. We're definitely dealing with some sort of AI uprising here or something. Wrong button. Oh, yeah. Seal morphs can bend their knees and crawl out vents is the thing. Not yeah. for moose. It is not for sheep androids at least. Like Wayland Yutani androids. Yeah, those would be able to. Oh, oh. It's reception, but we can't access that. Okay. Turn that off. I don't know if, with the speaker system, if that could cause distractions, or maybe, for, for all we know, it could draw the fucking Xenomorph over. I hope them to watch some lore videos, or the ones before bed, but... First, it would depend on how sleepy I am. A second, I'm not sure if that's a smart idea to do. One over there. Oop, multiple. Oh, great. They're getting in the way again. Now, let's see, Necro making a reference from the movie where the dude describes the alien as perfect life form. I thought you were talking about them and not the androids. No, we haven't seen the Xeno in a bit, though. I, ooh. I have heard them scuttle around some. I hope expect you to jinx yourself there. I don't know how they react to the androids. That one's coming closer. Normally, at least lore-wise, they will ignore androids unless the androids get hostile with them. Are you going to move? Oh, 
in. Something dead ahead. Okay, that that must have been the, the xenomorph. Okay. Uh, hello. Hughes, it's Ransom. I just got your query. Yes, I have been in our transmission relay archive, and I've done some decrypting. I'm looking for crew logs that passed through Sevastopol a while ago. I know you're concerned, but it's ancient history. It's just some stuff I need to know. A routine company transmission packet sent from the edge of Thetis before a ship started its trip home. Nothing's gonna break anything. This is Captain Dallas logging an initial report from the return leg of our Thetis voyage. Uh, when we get back home, I want a meeting with a shipping coordinator. My usual science officer has been replaced. No reason given. The new guy is more than capable, I'm sure, but only getting two days' notice for this kind of thing is quick. I'd just like an explanation. We'll be ready for our load when we get the call. Dallas, Astronomy Captain, signing off. Okay, so they did get the data off of it. Question is, where, where is all of it My then? Okay, let's mess with things even more. That we need on. That we need off. Ooh. Something right in front of us there. Are the Joes chasing someone else or something? Oh, there's one of them. Two in our way. I think we... Yes, we need to go that way. I think this one is actually just not moving at all. Yeah, and... I used to remember something that's a bit annoying. Uh, you, you know the alien is inspired by uh, H.R. Giger's artworks, right? Yep. He's a good artist. However, his uh, issue... Whenever he's mentioned in a video that he, he gets mentioned on, I notice a certain trend that's annoying. And that is no one seems to know where he's from <laughs> okay i won't say one has said he was he's from sweden one said he was from german one said he's from america and the list goes on i think i have heard so far like eight different countries whenever he's mentioned one of them did mention he moved yeah. about which fine but Seriously, it sh Faber should not... Uh, how does that happen that no one seems to agree with where he, he is from? Yeah. <clears throat> okay, I think... I think it's about time we find ourselves a safe spot. Oh yeah, because we're getting one close to the end. Okay. How many of us have been safe station? It, 
Is this okay, now they become rare? I think there was shooting by. Uh, uh, let's see. I think they're supposed to be... Now this archives log. They're supposed to be marked on the map somewhere, I think. Um... We need to go that way. Restore power. Restore. Okay, that that's him zipping through the fucking vents, I think. Is this open? Actually, we should be able to hack this now. Or uh, we need a key card. Fuck. Uh. Someone undid our screwing around with this, it seems. Um. Get, get out, get out. Yeah, it, it's just him screwing around. Or it, whatever. It's a murderous <laughs> feral xenomorph. Don't think it cares for pronouns. Again, one of these assholes. I didn't. I didn't even see it. It's there. Again, I did not get jump scared. I don't know. I feel like. That, okay. Had I been playing instead of heal, I probably would have got the jump scared. But I feel like I should have got the jump scared. Maybe I got a bit immune over watching so many horror games. Where is the I safe? Oh, there is a safe. I guess that's two jump scares on your end. Or Most did you, you get the fucking now as well? Dead. <laughs> yeah, I'm expecting us to get more jump scare from the alien, not the yos. Okay, and I think. I think. Okay, it's definitely. Oh, neat. Someone's photo. Something opened that door. Yeah. Something's just stepping around over there. Okay, some of those sound like footsteps, like a Joe. Okay, whatever it is, is moving away. So yeah, these little transit hubs aren't safe. Okay, all the same though, we put down a save. And yeah, don't know if we'll find another one of those within 10 minutes. So I think we'll have to call it here, huh? Yeah. And I think I'm actually going to look up a HRG at some point to see if someone knows anything proper about him. Yeah. Oof. <laughs> okay, now we can turn the damn light on. Okay. Uh, yeah. <laughs> we'll be busy with this game during October. And I don't think we'll really need to go beyond October with like six hours. Uh, each week, hopefully, for 24 hours about total, should be enough to finish the game. And mm, yeah, we did have. I, I keep forgetting what other game we had for possibly uh, playing as well during this. But on the, the weekends, we'll detected. be picking up. Yeah, dark side. But if we finish with, uh, with the, if we finish with this game, I don't know what that other game was we talked about possibly playing during this. Oh, but we'll yeah, what see. was it? I know <clears> we <throat> spoke about it. Like, one of them was as an idea, one of the... What was it called? Was it you within, or...? Could be. 
Yeah. That it one's be pretty begin... lengthy, I think. Yeah. Mm. I mean, we showcased one of them. And then there was one that was a very, very bloody that I don't remember the name of that we showcased. Mm. We'll have to look around. But for now, uh, yeah, let's go look for someone to raid before we end the stream. So ending the game. And let's see who are online. Uh, there. Okay. <laughs> Sounds like I need, I'll need to rush off myself. Oh, it's very busy. Okay, uh, I'll just I'll just name three people here. We have Azra Arcane, who is playing Space Marine Two. Then we have Theory Pop, who is playing Alan Wake Remastered. And okay, Roko is playing Rayman Raving Rabbits. That just did not expect to see that. And Let's do. Okay, I yeah, I go, really need to run off after this from the sounds of my own intestines. Uh, Profound Badness is playing Clock Tower 3. Any of those sound of interest, or shall I take a pick? I feel like Clock Tower seems rather fitting. Oof, Smith Ring 2, since they have their own versions of Seal Morphs. Yeah, let's actually go see. <laughs> let's go visit Azra. It's been a while, I think. Okay, yeah. I, I I bought Space Marine Two. I haven't gotten too far into it, but I do like some aspects of it. Like, it some bits remind me a bit of Armed and Dangerous, with the enemies just being a living fucking flood. <laughs> okay, copy the name slash raid and paste, uh, and of course I misspell raid somehow. Okay. Uh, but of course, before we uh, before we start that off, thank you everyone who's been watching now or later. Thank you Necro, thank you Marco, uh, thank you Jess, and uh, uh, thank you Malice Kiva as well, and yeah, as well for the follow. And Lisa, thank you for the follow as well. And of course, thank you as always, Drake here. You're welcome as always, my friend, and thank you all for joining and watching. And yeah, if nothing gets in the way, we'll continue with this tomorrow. And in the weekend, we'll get started on Dark Side Detective 2, A Fumble in the Dark. Even though it technically doesn't have the two, it's still a sequel. <clears throat> Yay. Well, yeah, for now, uh, let's get the rate started. And yeah, thank you all again for watching. And until next time, have a nice day. And until then. Be safe, everyone. Sleep well. And yeah, push out for the aliens. And... <laughs> Watch out for Joe. <laughs>